So we're here in New Hampshire. We're at the Mount Washington Auto Road Hill Climb this weekend. Uh, you might remember the video of Travis Pastrana ripping up this, this mountain. It took him like six and a half minutes or something. We're gonna do it way slower. I was gonna set it up, it's beautiful here. I took a little ride yesterday, I saw the sunset over the mountains and there's a fog and there was this mist and it's all green. Uh, it was amazing. But sorry, you don't get to see that because now it's raining, it's really gross out. So New England, you know, it's old, everything is quaint. I'm at a historic hotel. When you're selling a house or something, you call it cozy and that's code for small. So historic means like the carpet's old and the paint is peeling. But if you saw this at a Red Roof Inn, you'd be like, oh, this is horrible. This is, you know, one and a half stars on Hotels.com. Doesn't have a mini fridge or a microwave. But here, you'd be like, look how old and, and historic it is. It's, uh, this is, this is adorable. Let's golf. Washington Hill Climb has been going on since like 1973. The whole thing benefits the Tin Mountain Conservation Center. So all the little city kids come out and they can learn about nature. They can look at the ponds. There's like birds, trees, and, and rain. So it's, you know, it's educational, it's, it's conservation, it's nature, it's, it's a door, it's for the kids. Last time I was up here, was 2008 and 2009. I was on an amateur team called Fjorda Fruta. I was 22 and living out of my car. And my team was like testing the first Super 6 carbon frame that they made. I won the climb on that in like 55 minutes. And then the next year I came back and I went one minute faster. Keep in mind the record that Tom Danielson set was 49 in like whatever gears they had in 2002. I could, nine years later, I'm gonna go back and see if I've progressed five minutes faster. To go for the record here is arguably like the most ambitious thing I've ever tried. It's the highest ever recorded wind speed, 231 miles an hour. Well, we're gonna hope it's a tailwind tomorrow and I'll just coast. I'm competing for my own, just to find my own best self. Worst retirement ever is, is easing me into just being like a mature, emotionally healthy, fit person. Turn left onto Mount Washington Auto Road. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. How are you guys? Tomorrow's weather looks great. The event, more than likely, will happen tomorrow. <laughs> Sunday's Sounds great. It's cool. It's kind of full circle, yeah. Most of the people who come here are just like trying to do their best time. There's like five guys wanting to win. And until VeloFix arrives, I put my own wheel on, like an amateur. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Nice to meet you. Welcome. Thank you. Cookie man. That's right. Here he is. Yeah. In the flesh. I'm just saying that toll house thing is teasing me with the cookie thing, you know? I know there's cookies in there. I know there's cookies. We only give out cookies on our birthday. And that was just a couple weeks ago. 156 years. For the... For, for the, the auto road. Yeah. Oh, wow. This is the steepest climb I've done. I haven't had a dork out on bike stuff. It's also the hardest record to get. It's cool because it's an event also. The dirt section is less steep, but it's still steep. And then the very last bit is like in the 20%. There's no, there's no place to recover and there's no place to like save energy for. My, the computer thing that I saw said it was 7.3 miles and this says eight. So we already have an issue. I'm going with this speed suit tomorrow. They give you a lot of numbers for an event where like you're gonna be crossing the finish four minutes from anybody else, hopefully. That's Phil one, Phil two. Or I guess that's this is Phil two and that's Phil three. Did you, did you kill Phil one? <laughs> I can show you my depressing dinner. To the untrained eye, this might look like a recycling bin, but this is a refrigerator. So we fill it with ice. This is my apple juice, and then I have some spinach. This is so pro. You guys don't even know how pro. And then I have Cliff protein. I'm gonna make a smoothie. You gotta tape your protein mix. I once got my entire suitcase full of uh, orange Gatorade. Put all of my stuff in the washer dryer. <laughs> the water is just orange flavored wash. And I don't have a spoon, so I'm using this comb, which was packaged. Oh, man. I think it's tasty too. Nobody else does. My best rides are like just one of these three hours before. It's race day, as you can tell by, I got my tubulars on. Uh, this is my game face. I could try to convince myself I don't care, but I would still go 400 watts up this thing. Yeah. Like, 
Which is something I need to cure myself of. <laughs> I'm gonna start taking parts off the bike soon. We're here in the sweaty VeloFix van. And, uh, all right, walk me through. All right, we took off the uh, front derailleur. You're just gonna run the small derailleur. 1128 to 1132. Changed out the rear derailleur. Yeah, ceramic speed chain, which has the lovely white expensive dust. So we got the pizza pan on the back. Yep. The shorty bars. Yeah, we're gonna wrap the bars. I'm not saving that many grand. When the cannon goes off, the top-notch riders be off on their way to the summit of Mount Washington. Go riders, good luck! If there was one climb that I could have and like put on 50 pounds and let my whole bike fitness go, it would probably be this one. The first place guy last year was about 52 minutes, and the record is 49. Phil Gannon is hoping to be faster than that this year. So they're at 29 minutes. Once it gets super steep, you, you can't even really get the power up. Paced it probably 350 to 380 the whole way. The dirt part, that's kind of the shallowest area. And this time it was kind of just sticky, so there wasn't any recovery. Bill Gannon's up by about two minutes. As he draws closer, we're going to keep a careful eye on this clock. Go! Cookie Monster, go! Cookie Monster, go, go, go! Amazing, amazing ride. And the leader is, in case you haven't heard me yet, Bill Gannon, the Cookie Monster out of North Hollywood, California, 31 years old. The record was 49.24. I was like low 51. The dirt was letting me down, but not, not a minute and a half's worth. I'm glad that it doesn't feel as bad as losing a race. <laughs> That's like a relief in this whole thing. It's like it sucks to not get whatever records, but like it's not getting caught with 500 meters to go at nationals or something. Like that. Thankfully, I don't have that roller coaster anymore. Wow. This is a tradition at Mount Washington Auto Road Hill Climb. Mr. Hart. Uh, he provides turkey for all of us. It's a, it's a Thanksgiving turkey dinner. There's someone carving it. It's super weird, but that's how it works here. We've been doing this probably 15 to 18 years that we've been coming up to Mount Washington for either running races or bike races. Oh. And the people love having a little bit of Thanksgiving in June. Who eats so, more, runners or cyclists? Uh, I think runners eat more. All right. I think runners That's eat a challenge. More. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody's yeah, got to yeah, step yeah. it up. Yeah. If I get a bone in my thing and choke on it, this is who I sue. No one's making me do this. It's not my job. This was my stupid idea. But, like, here I am, like, almost vomiting at the top of Mount Washington, and it's, it's just for me. It's sort of cool to know that I have that, and it's also a little unsettling. <laughs> I still dream of not needing to win anything, be that like a hill climb or like a digital image of a crown <laughs> on the computer. Um, and try, I'm, I'm actively trying to convince myself that these are things I don't need in my life. And maybe when I can't get them, I'll make peace with that. Apologies to New Balance. I'm breach of contract right now. But they don't make an ironic American flag hoodie to my knowledge. It's made in Pakistan. Mm -hmm. You can't make this up. Ten dollars well spent, right? Yeah. Huge round of applause for your winner. Stop. Clap. He oh. hiked up just for you. Thanks. Thank you. You're welcome. Awesome job. How long did you hike up? Three hours. Three hours. <laughs> I don't see how they're not immediately sold out of this jacket. Yeah. You know what I mean? There were so for, many of them. For ten dollars, everyone here should be wearing one. There's a sad possibility I will come back here and geek out my bike and get on a plane and rent a car and and go a minute slower because that's how the world works and I'm 31 and it's you know it's <laughs> the, yeah we might we might just keep riding that that weird uh, that weird horse. eating chair. That's where that, that's where we are. There's a little sea salt. <laughs>